morning. Morning, Kathy. Okay, um, we got the new section and uh, we got one uh, new student, Dennis, and uh, he uh, cannot, some echo, right? The sound. Okay. Come to today's class and uh, later. Uh, so we have also um, online classroom and uh, um, so we have the classroom and we discuss things and post the homework there. So better um, taking class and uh, join the online class as well. Um, so later you can watch the um, video and learn and do homework and ask questions there. Okay, um, let's just uh, start uh, today's class today. We are uh, basically to review the whole characters for the phrase um, to write, to finish the painting and the write the phrase uh, in calligraphy style on the painting. Um, Okay, so uh, the Gloria, I, I mean, Victoria, I have a question. Uh, Emily? Yeah, yes. Can you explain a little bit the meaning of this um, quote? I don't quite get the... Um, the... Oh, the meaning? Yeah, yeah, the poetry of it. Okay. Is is it a um, is it a common phrase or is it from a poet line from a poem or for from a poem? Good question. Um, um, so we learned the characters. Um, you know, um, basically we learned the characters. Um, we learned each meaning, right? And uh, uh, for the phrase we are working on, and also for the single characters, also we can use other places, right? But this phrase, yeah, um, uh, good, good question to ask. Uh, in this, uh, this phrase um, with, their, uh, with the meaning, uh, normally, you know, in the, in the poem or in the phrase, the, the whole sentence, the meaning, not just the single, uh, the, the characters, like a one uh, plus one plus one put together, right? So um, the meaning of that is, uh, I put that in Google, <laughs> Google give me uh, the meaning and the, translate, the translation and I put on our handout. So which means um, uh, the, the flower, the lotus flower under the sunshine um, with the sun reflection uh, shows more beauty. Um, from the characters, one characters by one characters is um, reflections of uh, we, 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 uh, with sun, under sun, reflection in sun, in reflection of the sunshine, mm, lotus flower uh, shows a different red or um, more red, another red. Um, of course, actually uh, indicated more beauty of red. Make sense, Emily? Yes, thank you. Okay. Yes, uh, also a uh, good question to ask Paul. I almost forgot, I need to explain. Because I saw um, uh, Hui, um, one, of, uh, one of our students, when uh, she practiced the uh, calligraphy, I checked the um, homework yesterday, and I saw she put the, the just the one meaning for the uh, the the pie, pie here. Um, you know, lo lots of places means don't, do not, right? And also means different. So here means a special, special, or especially beauty. Um, another red, different red, or even more beautiful red, like that. Uh, but also be with the meaning of uh, uh, do not or different 
and also fairware. Um, fairware. Uh, so uh, she put the uh, meaning of uh, leave, leave. You know, leave the place, leave for some other place. Um, so not the meaning, not the meaning here. Yeah, good question to ask. Good question to ask. Here means uh, different red, more beautiful red. Uh, really enjoy the the lotus underneath of the. I mean, under uh, in the sunshine of the, you know, reflect 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 the sunshine shows more beauty. Okay, let's do the uh, review and uh, the characters. Uh, from last 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 time, okay. Um, and I will uh make the order of the a real phrase, and let's review that. We learned this uh last time the this um reflect right. See my see my desk. Yes. Okay. So um, basically, I said um, the, as the uh, sun radical. This actually pretty big. Normally, the the sun radical is occupied as radical is occupied about like a two thirds. And the right hand side, I think I said a couple of students, the last stroke do not uh, like hang on there too high. See about the same level, touch the bottom looks more uh, steady, right? Sturdy. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, you hear uh, seems like the one lag. <laughs> two up that's the reflect and uh, i think um this time i'm be happy to see um lots of uh i mean this is most of you did very well for the walking style and for the um, cursive style and kathy did beautifully and uh, uh hui did be beautifully um and um uh, uh, I'm not surprising for the Emily. Very good. So um, standard. And uh, the walking style, put them together. I just remember the last uh, um, four hour problem I saw in the homework. So this not too big. Because just radical, and the last joke, last stroke, do not want to, you know, too high, because make the very sturdy ending, something like that. Or consider the next character, probably you know, do some things. The lift stroke, you know, shows something that, but do not really on purpose hook here. Mm -hmm. That's not the meaning. So you need uh, need uh, need to understand the meaning for that. Um, and that this this one is really running style, cursive style. Okay, with the the and the back to Kathy, you did very beautiful. Thank you. Uh -huh. And this, I'm very happy to see, like Hui and uh, Emily, you did this with the little, um, I mean, the little uh, vertical in this uh, clerical style, um, you know, uh, shows um, forceful power. With a little bit of changing direction, not uh, ninety degree perpendicular things, you know, like that. Mm. 
because <laughs> carving. Mm -hmm. So later, when you write on the uh, painting, you can you can you can do that later on, right? Uh, even for the calligrapher, you need to try some some things you are really comfortable and write the whole face on the painting. So we are still practicing. So this style kind of uh, um, very, I mean, carving, right? Or a stick to write on the sand. I always say feel some uh, spectacle. And this, uh, from last class, we emphasize on the, the stroke, the way to do stroke, plow, plow. Bounce back. Very important. So this uh, clerical style kind of use this plow. I mean, the way to do. You know, the plow on uh, the stroke um, means the way to do. You doesn't have later. You will find you doesn't have to do. Um, you know, really from how degrade anger, even perpendicular, you feel like, you know, hold, hold and uh, uh, use the power of a plow and you can do the stroke like that, shows the line differently, differently. Okay, and the second character is I need to, um, Well, actually, uh, not in handout. Uh, at the um, email, I send you the 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 picture for the sun, the day. You have that. The this character. Standard style for that. We learned before, right? The sun. I always say, remember this way from the image of that. <laughs> okay, and uh, uh, walking style, I just go a little bit, uh, you know, faster and more connected to do like that. And uh, uh, walking style, just uh, back to the center and doesn't really do the seal, the bottom seal stroke. like that. And the clerical style, um, when we learned that the, the characters, um, we didn't learn this style yet, right? We only have the three styles. So you can imagine, put it more flat, stroke by stroke, plow or carving. More, you know, at the co corner, at the turning part, more stroke by stroke, do not give really soft curve one here in the clerical style. Carving, plow, plow. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's the two characters. Reflect sun or in the, in refract of the sun, okay, the order. Reflect sun. Later, I'll put the things together, or you can see the handout. I put the printing characters there. Okay, and then four styles. Lotus. Lotus with the grass top, right? Two cross. This grass top. And now we review what's this radical underneath at left? What's this radical? Person. People, people person. Yeah, as radical and put one stroke vertical. It's 
standard. And the walking uh, for the, the top of the um, radical, the two um, crosses, grass top, actually people can put them together, can put them together by one stroke like that and connect with that. So walking style, that and uh, uh, connect with this slant and that and uh, like 12 thing for the box. That's very common for walking style. And uh, on the grass style, or say uh, running style, cursive style, more faster. And uh, for the bottom of this can even circle thing. This part is the same and more connect for this part. That's very common. Um, so as I explained uh, many times, so some um, looks like a circle, circle thing, uh, circle thing, but in calligraphy writing, um, um, it's not very smooth, uh, very um, rush, just a circle, very fast circle. It's like uh, even the you know, faster riding, looking, but still with uh, um, some pause, with rhythm, with rhythm. So we know something here and here and the, like a vertical things here. So make things some, you know, a little bit, can you tell, a little bit like the uh, pause, like the, when you dance, when you dance, you want to circle in you know, the whole body, you know, a little bit, you know, some two to three paws and make the whole circle, right? Um, so here a little bit, that's why I say not the perfect uh, curve, but with some pause, probably in your feeling, you know, uh, for your breathing and make something a little bit of squarish, a little bit of squarish things. See here and, you know, a little bit of pause and smooth go, something like that. That's common for um, clerical, I mean, the running style, cursive style. Um, let's add the uh, clerical style. Clerical style actually um, very close to the um, standard style. Standard style appeared later on paper. And just to remember, this is carving on hard surface, metal or stone. Later, I bet, um, without a sample, you can do that. It's carving, right? Or say, plow. Mouth can make it a little bit flat. And the hook cannot be that sharp, right? And the, this, this is Lotus, right? Yes, yes, Lotus. Okay. Lotus. Thank you. Mm -hmm. um, and also on our sample, uh, sample painting, the artist um, wrote is more, even more um, an early style, uh, still. Uh, seal carving style, seal carving style. So lots of uh, straight line and uh, like triangle, uh, squarish uh, strokes you can see. And for, the, for this um, clerical style, some clerical style use that too. You know, for the two cross, right like that. Really like the original, like two, we talked about two like sprouts <laughs> just to come out you know, the image like a two sprouts like that. And uh, you don't have to do that, yeah. 
but some people still like that. Okay, um, and the flower. This is a lotus. And we say lotus flower. <laughs> Uh, later, we, we, will, we will learn the uh, rose flower, <laughs> anything put flower. Okay, flower, same, same radical. Yeah, see, so far the same. That's why I say build the things, we learn lots of you know, elements, then compose things. Only this part a little bit different. This is the flower. Um, walking mm -hmm. style, you can do the uh, grass top together. See the same with the lotus. And uh, the uh, cursive style, a little different looking. See the handout, I have too small space. <laughs> Clerical style, just to, you know, put it carving. no sharp and bounce back instead. Or like this joke, some people do earlier stop and the like other uh, stroke to do like diagonally, then do the goose tail flying thing at the end. That's the flower. Okay, and for the uh, like do not or leave or different or other type, uh, we have the characters for the beer, right? Mm -hmm. Standard style, and we just we just learned right, and the uh, walking style. Walking style with this stroke, uh, do first. And the hook more free. Just show a little bit and start to do next characters. Okay, um, that's what I'm talking about. Um, again, the circle, the circle uh, part. Um, you know, a little bit of squarish, but um, it's still, you know, in the cur cursive style, running style, uh, the wholeness shows uh, like a circle things. So, doesn't have to, have to be the, um, you do not want to show which one is perfectly uh, straight vertical. Mm -hmm. Like two strokes like that and then Clerical style. And they put the one, one stroke. Okay. 
Okay, the mouth, remember, flat. Here, actually, another stroke, not very soft turn. Bounce back. And this become the horizontal. Okay, and uh, the order uh, type. Remember what's this radical means? Again, just to review. What's this radical? Wood. Wood, good. Who is speaking? Emily. Oh, Emily. Type. And the right hand side, the left left hand side is a word, the right hand side is a goat, sheep. Okay with two, two horns. <laughs> okay, um, walking style, easy. Um, I forgot who's, uh, who's this word, word radical, I said, the, the the press when you lift after press lift because we see simply from um from the two strokes become one like a one stroke right actually it's not two stro strokes by connected and change the direction so from uh, down to bottom and uh, I, I mean uh, up to bottom up to bottom and it become one press to bottom and then kick lift this way to do the walking and the, the um, running. Um, but um, see, need to do, okay, look at me. I do some over, 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 over showing thing. Should be to do like that and from bottom, underneath that. Mm -hmm. This is correct. Um, do not do what, do not do, Look at me, do not do that. Mm -mm. Cause we have other, other radical. Only this. <laughs> so it's different. Uh, this shows a wood radical. So from underneath and then kick, lift. Even very tight, see this one a little bit loose. Um, you can see from bottom, from underneath of the press. Mm -hmm. Carving on hard surface. So there's a little bit like the triangle shaped things and the whole, whole things very flat. Uh, big goose tail flying, uh, typical strokes shows here along this tour. Okay, that's the type. Last one.
So I add some um, the because we uh, didn't learn the we learned the characters before, and uh, we didn't learn the um, clerical style just. So I add the clerical style um, for uh, this class handout and uh, uh, we still review the whole things before we learned. Anybody remember um, what's what is this radical for? Is it silk? Silk, 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 silk. See, um, like the twist, right? Here, twist. It shows more um, image uh, looked like uh, in the clerical style. <laughs> And uh, the walking style is very faster. Like one, two, down, and the third one, press up. One, two, press. to do that, which means um, walking and make it more connected and uh, uh, simple. Mm -hmm. um, flower here. And also uh, the running style, cursive style, a little bit different for the silk, uh, the radical, see your hand out. It's like the number three, but more clear, see a sample. Mm -hmm. And the clerical style. The clerical style is like the painting, but remember uh, carving to um, pull, you know, pull out plow, okay, carving plow, um, like two circles. And, uh, you know, lots of uh, um, the vertical is not be straightened yet. Um, by that period of time. So horizontal is horizontal and the vertical, typically the red one uh, is like that, a little bit of anger. And again, I could just zigzag some things. Yeah. You can show a little bit. Uh, goose tail flying things. Okay, that's how much for the um, the characters. Um, and we'll also learn the artist's name, right? You can check the um, uh, handout for the Pan Tian Shou and also um, homage to the Zhi Jing Pan Tian Shou. You can check out and uh, when you feel comfortable, uh, to write and make the whole thing <laughs> on the on your on your painting. Okay, now um, let's do uh, finish the um, the painting. Um, I saw like on uh, the Michael's last time. Very good like a masterpiece <laughs> there already. And uh, Kathy's, you know, I like uh, Kathy. Um, I'm sorry? I 
okay, I can do both. You know, lots of time. <laughs> so this is on um, the single, single shawn rice paper, very thin and uh, smeared. And, uh, uh, you know, yeah, we say the, the plow, the plow stroke um, and the calligraphy, what different from the um, the hard, uh, other, 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 uh, other, uh, other pen work need to be um, your power, your power go through the back of your paper. See, um, if back of your paper shows, see this shows not enough, not enough. My painting shows. You know, first when I talk, I, I even recon it didn't recognize this is the bank. <laughs> okay, the plow stroke. And uh, I saw your discussion in the classroom. Um, I mean, more than one people at least, you uh, like the Pantian Show styles painting. And the Pantian Show we talked about, um, um, he like he also very good at the finger painting, finger painting. Think about what's the finger 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 painting is more direct, more direct, and your fingers. I, th I think I tried once at classroom, right? Um, here, I mean the, in the uh, Zoom class, uh, you you cannot not like the brush very brush tip very soft right hair here and absorb more um, ink or color you know water moisture and your finger go very stiff stiff um, okay so even we use a um, brush um, thinking about the plow uh, the plow um, the way to plow and. Uh, uh, you know, like a finger painting, like a hard one, um, make the um, lines or uh, your paintings more powerful, more um, meaningful. That's uh, his, uh, his style. Um, very typically his style. And we talked about he is not just artist. Um, he's also an educator, educator. So um, his way to do not very, you know, sometimes it's just for uh, 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 some artist is very, very, you know, just uh, himself like to do that or very odd way to do. Uh, Pan Tian Shou is educator, so um, very, uh, how do I say standard or very um, himself educated person and he is the professor and the leader um, of the educator. So very, um, I mean, normal way um, we can learn. Okay, um, I think last time we did, I did, I don't know how much you did after class for your painting. Uh, did you continue? Did you con did you continue some or uh, nobody continue any anything? Um, I'm still do, doing some things. I think to con to be continued for the uh, use my this brush, the rest ink, dark ink. Uh, see what I do. I need to do some dark young leaves halfway a little bit opened like the arrow things here. Plow, I think plow. Go slow a brush and with some kind of shaking, some kind of the paw, paws. Not, not very parallel, yeah. Um, Kathy, I saw your um, uh, working a little, a little. I don't know if it's a draft or what. A little bit of things I want to uh, suggest. I can see so here. I saw some something here. The leaves a little, a little, a little bit too parallel. Do you think like the, a little bit? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes we, you know, only see the uh, see the tree, but always a little bit of one eye to look at the whole composition. <laughs> yeah. Okay, and the other leaves with some um, 
like a horizontal, but not perfect horizontal. Anyway, we, we, we try to, you know, copy the idea can, can not stem for that, cannot really, you know, copy the one stroke by one stroke, right? Um, they are in group, but never do things um, parallel, right? Two parallel. Let's get to the stem here. Okay, I trust you. Bar, uh, to finish everything dark, <laughs> use my ink. And here's some, you know, grass, uh, like the way we do bamboo or we do orchids. Um, and I saw um, Kathy's didn't didn't exactly copy, but got the I got the idea and kind of abstract, very good. And sometimes, you know, whoops, oh, I did some things, you know, a little bit I do not want. And you can, sometimes you can break a little bit, break a little bit. Uh -huh. And here, uh, I think I need to break some things here. And some things hard to um, de define uh, what what is what. Sometimes just you know if you you need need some lines. <laughs> uh, and one of um, Pan Tian Shou's style is he particularly like less color, just red and ink. You know, for the lotus. In other ways, say. For lotus, just the ink. He used lots of ink. Sometimes, you know, the eagle, uh, he has very, uh, next time, I think, uh, I mean, later we can do that. You know, very famous, like the e very famous e eagle or crow, you know, big bird on the um, very famous brand of Chinese ink, the ink bottle box, <laughs> Pantene shows bird, you know, the bird things, just the ink. Just the ink, and in this case, this is his style. This this style, uh, this uh, uh, I mean, the painting for the lotus mostly a little bit of red um, for the flower, just that, and the rest <coughs> of them only ink, light <coughs> ink, and uh, um, the dark ink. Now I think I want some light light ink, um, really light ink, and I try to. You know, no matter um, you, I mean, which part you uh, started, doesn't matter. Because after class, my calligraphy class, I used the rest of the thing, uh, my ink uh, to do. Um, and uh, uh, I want to do the, the big leaves first. And I uh, think better I use the larger brush because um, otherwise, I need to uh, press a lot um, for the root of the brush. If a small brush, I wanted the larger stroke, larger stroke, right? I need press a lot, and it shows the the stroke shows a lot. Um, I'm the root of the brush is too stiff, especially for like a lotus. Lotus need to be uh, the big leaves and the very, you know watery looking. I do not want a little bit the watermark very small looking. Okay, now I want to do the uh, the leaves. Leaves even um, not very defined, but look at that. Um, we see read, read the original painting, read. Okay, not just a look at. Uh, uh, you need to think about, okay, the mass, where is the um, imaginary center? 
for the larger for the lar larger one, the bigger one, I think here something center. Then you make your strokes very um, certain, right? Like one stroke, da da, to one stroke, then to the center, okay. That's one leaves here, right? And uh, there is the other one with empty center, uh, imaginary center, didn't cross, I mean, didn't circle any, like the button one for the center, but you need to read carefully and uh, uh, see where is the center. Mm, probably here, I think. So all the strokes, I mean, to the center indicated. Here shows this half, right? So basically like that. And then some uh, small, uh, like the dot things need to be very wet. Uh, on the semi-sized paper, when you dot that things a little bit like the hard to get the, the um, I mean the rounder one sometimes the press just like the print the shape of the brush. Actually, I think do you think a little bit a little bit the uh, blue color there uh, to the ink for the dot indicate the lighter, right? Something here. Small leaves. You, you need also not just uh, I mean stroke by stroke to copy the master cop masterpiece. Also need to watch your um, painting, right? Where you need to save, uh, you know, because it's a handmade. <laughs> You need to do some things reasonable for your painting. Here we say a S shape, right? Uh, for the whole composition. So need to some need, need some things here connect. Okay, and also I think like the two strokes um, um, he made, he he did like a little bit like that. Yeah, use a larger brush. I mean, for like the larger mass of that, I do not want to uh, use really small brush. That's why some some uh, time when do load is I always say the big wash brush prepared to the class. Otherwise. I need to press a lot to get the uh, larger stroke, right? And uh, um, I need to press to the, the heel, the bottom of my brush, the bristle. So here, of course, very stiff, very hard, and the show stroke very stiff. I do not like it, it's like a larger brush. Mm -hmm. um, did you notice um, the water marks here? I'm using actually um, the red star shown rice paper, red star shown, uh, which is ex uh, very expensive and shows um, layers for um, you know water mark. So some people like it, and some people afraid of <laughs> um, show everything. But you know, for the watery things, I like it. I like it. Okay, uh, seems he did some things like a dot on the little leaves, right? You know, more layer, a little bit more, uh, more fun. Hmm.
you know, copy the ideal idea and uh, you know uh, practice and we are you know doing things learning things learn by doing um, some also some lighter lighter ink for the uh, grass right make it I think another layer of things like this closer this is like the medium and this is far um i think that's enough okay i'm going to um so we saved um uh, the room for writing here right um it's actually uh need preparing um to do perfect and uh, i think if you like you can do a little bit like a second line second layer for the leaves do some a little bit uh, uh vein things or um i think the artists do some use some kind of the um overnight ink overnight to do so automatically some particles there and some lines shows probably not the second layer uh, do the re, do the say uh, and other time probably but you don't have you don't have to do because we got in the painting we see the dry wet like dry wet um dark light right i got some dark things already so i can do this the things very just a xie yi, meaning right meaning writing right meaning writing and xie yi also meaning writing also means um shows more spontaneous right so more freestyle okay now um writing and the two places um you will see lots of uh, uh, traditional uh, famous painting with lots of uh, um, writing here, there, any uh, any other places. Uh, the uh, very lots of spaces uh, occupied by calligraphy. Some is the subject, um, I mean subject for the uh, painting, and the author does, um, the painter does. Uh, and some are uh, later the collector, people collect it and write some things here to describe uh, um, um, where I got that or how, how do I enjoy uh, this piece, appreciate this piece, write uh, a phrase there and uh, put the collector's seal on that <laughs> and uh, blah, blah, blah. Uh, uh, collected and some even you know the empire's uh, seal. Okay, um, I put he here and also uh, we write the subject uh, sub uh, subject matter for for the this. Okay, which style doesn't matter. See the um, the painting show the artist the writing use the seal script style use very um it's very uh, steady right steady and the stable looking things uh but the the painting itself actually very um like a freestyle meaning writing right not elaborate not elaborate okay here mm, not my ink not dark enough. Draw any more. Ah, I know. Also, my brush because I I use uh, for um, light ink. Uh, why don't I use this uh, Seven Wolf um, uh, three um, sheep one? 
smaller brush to do the calligraphy. Because I, this is very small painting actually, narrow things. I do not want to do really large characters. You know, when you write, you can do some things, um, some things in between, um, in between walking and the stand, standard style or in between walking and the running style. See, when this sun um, as, um, Radical is pretty like a tri um, uh, rectangular shape, right? And by itself, um, it's kind of a flat. And to make the characters um, uh, clear, balanced, and also watch the whole line <laughs> vertically. Uh, and the size, I'm tending to become bigger. <laughs> Okay, um, in, uh, in the reflection of the sun, lotus uh, flower is uh, uh, more, especially even more, um, it's different type of red, which means I really think, did you see that? I found the lotus on the sunshine is beautiful. Also, my 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 painting want emphasis on the lotus flower. This doesn't matter, doesn't matter, doesn't matter. <laughs> uh, enjoy the flower, enjoy the the red. Other things are almost very dark, just the black. Um, so don't do not ask why uh, flower is red and uh, leaves are all dark, <laughs> uh, gray, um, and uh, the uh, black. Okay, so here um, and uh, some things um, you know um, can write the whole image blah 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 artist right, and my name. about two characters uh, lower for the second um, uh, line to do some things like to say, uh, what year, uh, lunar year, or say um, other things like homage somebody, S smaller, uh, smaller size. Home match. Uh, 
盘，铁，手。呃、uh, ，I forgot how to write show. Uh, for the okay, just write to simplify. Um, and then the, this is homage uh, the artist Pan Tian Shou, and then uh, still, cause better I have some things down here, right? Mm -hmm. The Xin Chou, the lunar ear we learned. And the uh, name and later uh, seal uh, here, seal here. Later I'll put here. Um, okay, I think here I can leave it um, just uh, empty because um, uh, I explained. Um, lots of places people can write the collector's um, write a phrase, write a sentence, or um, put a name, put 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 his uh, collector's seal here. Uh, and also, if you think here is too empty, you can use another mood seal, mood seal, you know, mood seal to put about 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 here, about here. Okay, to make the whole whole things um, look the more, I, I don't know, full or complete. Yeah, lots of places you have you have more than one seal, right? Name seal is after your name, beside your name, and the, the mood seal, you know. Victoria. Uh, yes, question put here. Yeah, it's Kathy. And, and um, any of these places you want to uh, balance the whole things. Yes, Kathy. Um, in the first line of vertical line of characters, is the fifth character the do not leave or other character? Uh, say again, I didn't get your question. I'm the, sorry. It's re reflect, sun, lotus, flower, and then. Different, the, different type, red. Okay, <laughs> so that so the do not leave other. That's that's. Uh, I just I don't have my I have too many characters sitting in front of me right now. <laughs> uh, okay, so, yeah. Check the handout. Check the print pretty printing style. Okay, and printing it, but style. It, but it's the the character that's do not leave or other correct. Um, Vic Victoria. Yes. Um, can I can I say something? Yes. Um, I I think Kathy is thinking that "bie" means "do not leave" instead of "do not" or "leave." Oh, um, is that uh, correct, Kathy? I well, I think so, but it's it's a different. It's the character is saying it's a different type of red, correct? So yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Different, so that, different he, type of red. Uh, here, actually, for the whole thing, um, um, the meaning is uh, more red, more beautiful. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Doesn't 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 ba mean also other? Yes. 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 Okay. Yes. So that that's the meaning here, but I still yes. think Kathy thinks that it also it means do not leave. Oh, 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 it, but right. it doesn't mean do not leave. It just oh, it means here actually no. Here actually no. Uh, he act, actually not the artist. Uh, artist uh, say that uh, he also borrowed the, the whole phrase from the uh, classic poem. 
Yeah, mm -hmm. here means uh, uh, it's not the the pie the pie um, do not means do not, but here definitely uh, means different type, uh, even more prettier, <laughs> and okay. with, with no meaning of um, uh, yeah. Do not leave red. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. All right. Thank, thank you, Victoria and Emily. I'm, I'm very sure. I'm very sure for this. Okay. Uh, yes, yes. Um, but uh, some uh, good question though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Feel free to ask. Feel free to ask. Yeah, right. Because sometimes in Chinese, um, uh, we have lots of like the ambiguous um, uh, uh, things. Yeah, two meanings. Or you can um, interpret this way or interpret that way. Uh, yeah for, um, but not, not this case, not this case. Um, and also I think um, one more, one more things, um, yes, just one minute. I still want to, um, to um, emphasis to um, uh, do the, our um, plow stroke, plow stroke. I think, um, um, in calligraphy and the Chinese painting, one concept is we do not want um, any 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 things. Um, okay, what's the plow 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 and uh, the stroke or the way uh, for for this. It doesn't have to be exactly like using tool like this direction. The actually versus what? Versus uh, rash. Versus um, careless. Versus uh, um, Perfunctory. <laughs> Versus slap dash. All those is the calligraphy and the um, Chinese painting strokes taboo. So um, this plow stroke doesn't have to be in any um, in any um, I mean certain angle and angle and uh, you just do things with very like a um, steady and uh, um, set it Instead of that, that taboo, and we want that's what we want. We want the strokes, right? And even you do th you do things you do things like a per like a, a perpendicular. You still feel like because in your mind you got the plow, you got the plow, the concept. You still can perpendicular your brush doing that way. Un understand? And uh, um, you know, even from uh, from different direction, you can do on uh, the lotus stem, lotus stem, right? From this way, plow, plow, right? From bottom up, plow. And also, you can do this way from uh, this way down, plow. Use the way. Um, yeah, just the mind. Um, in your mind, the concept of the plow stroke, plow stroke. To this are taboo, and uh, 
I'm glad um, uh, I found uh, since we um, introduced uh, the way to use your arm, remember to do the bamboo chunk, bamboo chunk, use your arm, you know, um, you pre pretended, you know, it got wounded on your fingers and you just you need your arm to move your arm to do the um, uh, the chunk of the bamboo, the way, and also use the way um, plow to do some uh, like lotus stem, some very powerful um, line. And also I mentioned even the waterfall, waterfall, right? Not just the smooth line, rainbow smooth line, not for that. So I think since we practice that and then we got concept, got idea of that, I think I'll, I'll I, I found uh, your calligraphy um, is making progress a lot. Actually, I found, I found, yeah. I don't know what do you what do you feel uh, the choreography and the painting, but um, I still want to emphasize on that. I think very helpful. I mean, for me and I found for for you guys and I found for um, Kathy's uh, characters um, choreography and also Hui's um, my choreography. Um, a lot um, impress, Im a, a lot make, making a lot um, progress. I'm glad to see that. And uh, so calligraphy is the um, long time like exercise and uh, every day very often, even people call it meditative things I mean to do. And we learn things um, like uh, learn by doing. Um, so, um, happy painting and, uh, practice and, uh, enjoy, enjoy. <laughs> and uh, also, um, yeah, Mike's, um, um, uh, no one, no one, no wonder, of course, uh, the Emily's, um, uh, characters and, uh, Emily's, uh, standard style and the strokes has a long time so Kung Fu already. And, uh, she uh, still learning um, uh, very uh, detailed things and the structure things um, very well. I think I appreciate um, this kind of, is, this is a kind of another ability, you know, uh, people, you know, got the like the 85 and still um, can move to the 90 uh, in the score from the 85 to 90, very hard, you know, from 90 to 95, it's very hard. You need to find something you want to go, uh, find something you want to learn and find a way you can make in progress, very hard. But uh, Emily did very, very, very well. And also she, um, I think started to do the uh, walking style and the running style very well. And uh, not, not, not shows at, very uh, first um, couple of times homework and then become more, you know, um, free to do and for the wholeness and the, the um, you know, the chi flow got the whole stroke in, uh, among the stroke very well. I I'm glad to see that. Um, and um, I'm think, I'm, I was thinking of the, uh, do I want to, um, um, I mean, have a break uh, for our click of stroke. And then I think probably, because uh, we have one year, uh, um, uh, uh, more than one year already, uh, last uh, April, last year, May, a a April, we started. And uh, um, I decided to uh, go uh, continue continue for uh, that one hour uh, every, 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 every week. Um, we, we, we talk about some principles, some uh, um, theoretical things, and also we practice some. Um, and uh, I'm going to um, continue my class to uh, next spring, next spring, to make the whole things two years and uh, uh, learn some um, basic characters, some way to do calligraphy and uh, um, so two years, we have more uh, phrase, more basic painting things uh, to do and the phrase uh, or some um, famous poem, poem, you know, sentence to write, to, to learn some things. So make it two years um, 
for my class. And uh, um, other students uh, want to join in any time, um, welcome, because we always like to build things um, each, each class and uh, uh, each class also um, a little bit um, individual. And also you can join the online class and watch the uh, earlier video. So after my two years class, we can always still watch the video, right? Okay, um, that's how much I want to talk about the plan of my choreography class and uh, um, approach your um, um, attend to my class and uh, uh, hope you can continue and uh, happy practice, happy um, painting. And I see your achievements already um, and very, very obvious. <laughs> I'm very happy to see that and uh, Kathy's characters and the Hui's characters um, and the Michael's characters, <laughs> right? Um, uh, and the paintings. Uh, very good, very good. And the Kathy's painting, I say, I, I say, some uh, I cannot even see the which piece, which piece of the leaf or which piece of the, a little bit abstract. But anyway, um, the lines they're all uh, correct, you know, beautiful, and uh, the calligraphy strokes, and uh, doesn't it do any, I mean, taboo things or, you know, things anything's wrong, correct. Anything is correct. Mm -hmm doesn't have to be, you learn the way, it doesn't have to be, I mean, copy each strokes. Okay, uh, see you next time and happy painting. Thank bye you. Bye. Thank you. Bye, bye, bye. everybody.